Now, your first one weather forecast with meteorologist Joey Marino. Good morning, everybody. Happy Wednesday. Hopefully you're having a great start to your day out there. We're starting off with plenty of sunshine, as you can see on our Mercy Health SkyTrack camera over by the Rochelle Airport. Just got a few passing high clouds uh, this morning, but because of the clear skies last night and the very light winds at the surface, temperatures did drop into the upper 40s in a couple of spots, including out in Freeport for a short period of time this morning. Also, Rochelle down to 49 right now, 54 in Rockford, 54 also up in Janesville, 53 out in Galena and 52 down in Sterling. Now winds very light out there, but they're not going to create uh, any issues for those that are going to be traveling out there this morning. Pretty calm up in Janesville, calm in DeKalb, three miles per hour in Rockford and three also in in Sterling. Now we did stay quiet overnight last night and because of a high pressure system over the state line this morning, we're starting off with plenty of sunshine. Now this high pressure system is going to continue to move eastward into the Ohio Valley by this evening, but it's going to keep us pretty dry throughout the day and pretty comfortable because if we look at the daily planner for today, temperatures do climb into the low 80s by this afternoon. We're going to see a few clouds build in by the early afternoon hours. They'll stick around with us into the evening and then we should clear out heading into the night tonight. So let's take a look at that using Futurecast as we head into tonight. That high pressure system is going to be moving to the east over the southern Great Lakes and the Ohio Valley regions, but that's going to keep us pretty dry, not only throughout the day today, but also tonight, just a few passing clouds. There could be some patchy fog as you make your way out the door tomorrow morning, but that's going to give way to a sun-filled morning. And then once again, a few passing clouds moving in by the afternoon. But because of the winds being out of the southwest tomorrow afternoon, temperatures are going to slowly climb closer to that 90 degree mark as we head into the upcoming weekend. But we're still going to stay sunny heading into tomorrow afternoon. Then by the time we get into uh, Friday morning, it's pretty much staying quiet for the rest of the work week. Thunderstorm chances do hold off until the upcoming weekend. Now, as I mentioned, temperatures are going to slowly climb towards the 90 degree mark as we head into the weekend, and that's because of a heat dome that is currently over the southwest United States. Very hot temperatures out there in the southwest United States, but once that heat dome uh, starts to expand, that's going to allow some of that heat to move eastward across the Midwest and then also into the state line by the upcoming weekend. So temperatures today, low 80s and a very comfortable afternoon for both today and tomorrow. But we climb into the mid 80s for tomorrow and then into the upper 80s for Friday and Saturday, getting closer to that 90 degree mark. And that summer like heat and humidity is likely going to be staying with us as we head into the start of next week. So you can see we stay quiet thanks to that high pressure system for today, tomorrow. And then also into Friday when that heat and humidity returns, our thunderstorm chances also return. You can see chance for thunderstorms Saturday and then into Sunday, then staying in the upper 80s as we head into the start of next week. But heading out to school this morning, Elliot, pretty quiet out there. Back to you.